Good morning, guys. Happy Monday, start of a new week. One second. Sorry about that. Um, Monday, new week. I'm excited for a new week. I feel so much better after just like a weekend to like regroup. <laughs> um, and I started my morning with Pilates. Oh my God, it burnt like absolute hell, which is obviously good because afterwards you feel like you've done something, but I was sweating. Um, and then I popped into Primark after, not gonna lie, it was very disappointing. I wanted some like winter pyjamas. Raining again. <laughs> um, I wanted winter pyjamas and they don't really have any. They don't really have any underwear sets either. Just weren't really serving, but I'll show you what I did get. So I got a festive candle. This is probably as festive as I'm going to get. Um, I just like this green candle and then it's got like these little leaves on and this is apple and smoked birch and it smells like Christmas. <laughs> it smells so good. They did also have a red one which smelled so nice but red just doesn't really go with my vibe. So I can't wait to like that. And then also I just got some of these socks which are super snuggly because this house as I always say gets freezing cold and I've been needing a pair of like big warm socks and I thought they were so cute they were four pound I got a grey beanie because I realized the other day I've lost mine and that was three pound fifty then I did actually get these pants you're probably not gonna be able to see it's like these kind of like cargo style trousers um and they were doesn't say the price oh 20 pound they do look super oversized but we'll give those a go and then i also just got these they're like room scented room sachets i'm going to put in a few of my drawers um and i got cotton so that was all i got so yeah i was a bit disappointed in the pajama underwear section but i mean i've probably got more than enough guys i can confirm these socks from primark are probably the best things i've bought in a very very long time like i cannot explain to you how soft they are also i have got the trousers on i bought but i'm gonna go put some trainers on and my coat and then head to shops and i will quickly show you my outfit of the day okay i'm heading out to the post office so i thought i'd just quickly show you my outfit of the day this is my new beanie that i showed you earlier it's actually such great quality it feels so nice just a gray basic tee the trousers i showed you earlier which i very much enjoy my coat from my fourth reckless edit this is one of my favorite pieces it's just so easy to wear and i love the back detailing and then just some New balances it's a super like easy casual look but i'm very much enjoying it anyway i need to go to the post office now and do life admin i completely forgot i had this parcel arriving so i thought i would unpackage it with you also this whole corner ignore it this is my messy corner but yeah let's unpackage this little beauty guys i am very happy right now <laughs> it's currently not even 8 a.m and i'm in bed i have just changed the sheets so i've got fresh sheets i've got a cupcake which lily kindly bought me because i was having a bad week a cup of tea and a candle going and i'm gonna finish up some work then i'm gonna try and get an early night but this situation makes me very very happy also i'm off to manchester in the morning i can't remember if i've told you that um so yeah got a busy day tomorrow but i will fill you in in the morning good morning guys so i'm just about to get ready as i mentioned last night i'm off to manchester today manchester today um 
I'm just getting ready for that. But I'm just about to get ready. Looked in the mirror and I'm so impressed with my skin. So I thought I'd give you a little update. So I got the skin booster on, was it Friday? Pretty sure it was Friday. Today is now Tuesday. And honestly, I'm so impressed. So this is me with literally no makeup. I've just put um, this brightening vitamin C cream on, which I've not used in ages and I love. But when I was applying this, I was like, oh my God, my skin feels so soft. And I mean, I've still got um, a little breakout here. But... I'm so impressed and it's literally like four days after um, and apparently you can see your proper results after the second booster which is in four weeks time so I'm gonna text Millie today and tell her I absolutely love it um, but yeah I'm just gonna quickly get ready got my cup of tea and I don't think I've got long actually I think I've got to leave probably in about 50 minutes so thankfully I don't take long to get ready okay I'm all ready I will show you my outfit when I'm downstairs I'm just gonna quickly put some lip gloss on I'm using this owl gloss gloss <laughs> but these are honestly so good they make oh they make you look like you've had a little lip plumping done I always love wearing these. This is shade Slip. I mean, how nice is that? This is Slay. It's got wood in my knee. Got splinter. There we go. Um, this is shade Slip. And then I've also used it with, well, lip liner, just like a natural daytime lip. But yeah, I'm nearly finished packing and then I'll show you my outfit. Okay, so the quick outfit of the day. I'm wearing this two piece from Because of Alice. It's literally the most comfortable thing. And because I'm gonna be in the car for, I think like four and a half hours, <laughs> I just wanna be comfortable. So it's actually a bodysuit and then leggings, but it looks like an all in one. Um, my New Balances, and then the shirt is from Nasty Gal. It's actually a pyjama shirt, um, but I bought this, and then the matching pyjama bottoms. The amount of times, or the amount of different outfits, sorry, I have styled this pyjama set in, it's probably been my like, best purchase ever. <laughs> I've got so many outfits out of this pyjama set, so I fully intend to wear this set out. Um, and then I'm going to whack on my leather trench over the top, I think. So comfortable, but still put together. Oh, I need sunglasses, actually. Okay, so finally checked into my room, was upstairs chatting with all the girls. I'll give you a quick room tour. This room is honestly so beautiful. So let me just quickly go back out here. <laughs> so you walk in here, and then you've got the lovely big bed we've got some goodies here oh my god wow this feels so soft i'll go through the products later um because we've got some goodies in there as well and then at the end of the bed we've got the beautiful bath stole a cupcake i've got a little living area here which is so sweet and then we've got some more goodies there and then I've got the bathroom. So I don't know if I've explained, I'm here with the Hut Group and Hut Group have quite a few brands. So my room is stocked out with all the brands that they look after. So I've got some really good products to show you, but I will do that a bit later as we do have some downtime shortly. But I'm just gonna go and check where Lauren is because she needs to come to my room and get a skirt. And yeah, I'll check in shortly. Just opened the wardrobe to get my bags. And I've got a beautiful gym kit. We are doing yoga in the morning, so I'm guessing that is for that. Also a robe. I love a bloody robe. Okay, so makeup is done. 
I just started doing my hair and then I realised I don't know if I should have my hair up because my outfit's a bit much. So I'm going to put my outfit on first and then do my hair. But I was going to go moisturise. <laughs> but I'm literally spoilt for choice. So I don't really know which one to use. I've used Espa so many times. I love all their products. So I'm going to try something new. So I've either got Golden Hour Moisturiser or I've got Transforming Body Lotion. Um, I might go for this. Actually, no. Instant Illuminating Body Lotion. I'm going to go for this one, even though my body is fully covered, but my skin can glow underneath. So let's give this a go. Oh. Okay, is this fake tan? Apply to the skin for a sun gradient glow. Apply it all over the body or use to touch highlight. Right, this looks bloody amazing. It's like glowy, but as I just mentioned, <laughs> I've got like a full body suit on this evening. So you're not going to see my skin. So I feel like this is a waste, but let's see. Like, look at how this applies. I don't want to get on this rope. Ugh. Okay, let's see. Oh, wow. Oh my God, that is beautiful. See this, can you? Oh, there we go. It's got like a shimmer to it and it's absolutely beautiful. That is stunning. So that is the Mio Golden Hour Body Moisturiser Instant Illuminating Body Lotion. Also smells like oranges. Smells beautiful. But, as I just mentioned, I'm fully covered tonight. And I feel like that's a waste. I wanna save that for when you can actually see my body. I'm gonna go for this one, which, wow. Smells like a bit like baby lotion. Some of the girls are talking about this upstairs actually. Okay, I'm all ready, but to be honest, I'm not convinced on my outfit. Don't know if I can pull it off. <laughs> so I'm gonna go to the girls' room, the girls being Lauren and Asha, get their opinion. And maybe steal some of their clothes, depending on what they say. I'm just not feeling my best. Or very confident at the moment so i feel like when i'm in this mood just whatever i put on i just feel a bit like ugh um but i'll show you it anyway because it is a fun outfit i just feel i don't know i just don't feel good um but one thing i do love are these earrings i'm absolutely obsessed with them so i'll link them down below oversized blazer as always and then i've got a lace top and underneath and then i've got like matching lace trousers obviously it's a bit extra i don't know if i'm cool enough for this like can i pull this off what do we think also on my lip i'm wearing this from alamasca and it is shade bang but it's great and then i've just paired it with my matte well lip liner dinner table we've got the naughty corner we're the naughty gals <laughs> this is our dinner setting it's like a mini wedding it's so cute today we will be drinking <laughs> Who did the shite in the toilet? Oh, 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 Do you know that is the first 
think that people will say to me if they'll be like, where are you from? And I'll be like, oh, Scotland. And they'll be like, disgusting. I'm like, I'm like, I never heard that. Do it again. Do it another one. Okay, so back from dinner, which was delightful. Some of the girls are actually still upstairs having a drink, but I'm gonna call it a night. Um, purely because I was just excited to come back to my room, get in bed in my cozies. And plus I do have a 9 a.m. start. I've got a 9 a.m. yoga class. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get ready for bed now. Trying to see if I've got a cleanser here that I can take my makeup off with. Okay, let's get this makeup off. I think I'm actually going to use this facial cleanser. Obviously, it's not going to focus. Oh my god, I was like, what is that tickling me? It's my bloody ponytail. Is there any better feeling? Oh my god, this feels and smells so nice. Wow, this smelled so good. Don't think that to double cleanse. Can't really look like some kind of Halloween character <laughs> with this outfit and this cleanser. Good morning, guys. I'm pretty much blending into the bathroom this morning, but I'm off to yoga for the life of me. I've only got one sock. I cannot find my sock. Uh, it's only me in this hotel room. Where has that one sock gone? Breakfast setting. <laughs> no? Your Sol Lauren's croissant. Thank you, honey. I'm not sad. Feeding me as always. <laughs> it, what do you mean explosion? It, the texture of the beans. I Just love beans. Like mushrooms. <laughs> so do you not like challenge? Do you like mushrooms? I love mushrooms. I love mushrooms. So, <laughs> I, no, listen, listen, I, I do not like mushrooms unless I've cooked them. Oh my god, I love mushrooms. This drama, this bean drama. <laughs> bean drama. Guys, I'm gonna sound like a bloody broken record. For the life of me, I cannot find this sock and I just don't understand like, how can one sock go missing and like I've packed up the room now I'm ready to go everything's tidy I just don't know where the sock is it's driving me insane getting a car back to London mm. okay so I'm all packed I've eaten just taking my vitamins which is so handy. They come in this like little pack. If you follow me over on Instagram, you've heard me waffle about this so many times. But they come in this pack, so they're just easy to take away with you if you go away. Um, and then I also just always like bring one of my collagen things. Now, I don't find this the nicest tasting thing. And I did start putting it in my water but I found if I just take it out of the sachet, I get for it quicker. So I literally just sachet it, wa drink water, sachet it, water, and it's done. I mean, it's not an awful taste. It's just a bit like bitter. Um, but yeah, I can't figure out where my sock is. So do I just wear one sock or do I wear no socks? Anyway, it's been a beautiful staycation and it was just so nice to catch up with some of the girls that I hadn't seen in a little while. But yeah, I'm going to finish packing up and then go downstairs. I couldn't be bothered to do makeup today and I'm just in my another version set because we've got four hours in the car again. So comfort is key. Also, I feel so bloated and so gross. I just realised as well there is an office literally right opposite me. And they're probably thinking, who the hell is she talking to? So I'm going to go. <laughs> Good morning, guys. I have had a very mm, slow, slow, slow morning. I literally woke up. I think I snoozed my alarm for maybe an hour and a half, which I never really do. I just couldn't be asked to get out of bed today. Um, I'm, I think I'm just so tired. 
and sorry i'm trying to concentrate why is this so hard um i think for me unless i have a clear plan of what i'm doing that morning so this morning i'll lie in bed and make excuses of why not to get up basically whereas if i plan my night the night before and i know what i'm getting up to do i find it a lot easier to get out of bed because i'm like right so i'm doing this this and this whereas this morning i was lying in bed i was like oh. like what is my day saying shall i just lie here so yeah i literally rolled out of bed haven't worked out yet i think i'm going to go this evening and i haven't even washed my hair so we are doing a slick back bun today and i thought i'd just quickly show you how i do it i mean by no means am i the best or a professional at these buns i mean i could have already done a better job there i'm just gonna do a lazy girl bun today so i start off by the way my washing machine's on if you can hear that um so i start off by just putting my hair in to the ponytail i try and get my part in as straight then i use this brush which i absolutely love it's money made beauty works brush but it's so good to get the hair smooth then i'm just going to grab some hair oil the oils that i like to use are either the gizzy one or i also love the moroccan oil and i just put some in my ponytail um no i was thinking about maybe leaving a ponytail but i don't fancy that um and then i just put some oil in my ponytail just uh one <coughs> give it some like moisture and two just because i feel like my bun goes nicer that feels so smooth. I'm trying to wash my hair less. Also, I feel like I could really, really do this bun, but let's see if I can literally just stick that back down. So my hair is, I wouldn't say greasy, but I think I'm on the third day of not washing my hair. So it's doing a pretty good job of sticking itself down but i do also love this product which is the bed head hair stick so then i just glue any flyaways back with this which is great so the one i've got that all secure i then grab one of these hair bands i just got these from primark or you can use a normal hair band i just feel like these look a little bit neater twist my ponytail around and then literally just wrap it around like so can you even see that and then you just have your bun so literally oh my wash is done and then i'm just gonna go in with this and then stick down the sides try and tuck those little sideburns in today i'm actually just going to work from home i've got some jobs to do so i'm actually just working from home today i've got some ads i need to do and obviously with the weather now you have like a two hour window of being able to work before it goes too dark but before i do any of that by the way this dress and gown is so cozy before i do any of that i'm gonna go and make a cup of tea because i can't function without one even though i have already done one this had one this morning also i got a huge new gym delivery yesterday so I will try and show you that at some point in this in this vlog, but 
but I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea. I'm gonna put a exciting, fun, happy <laughs> playlist on. I might even put the heating on, maybe just a little bit. I'm so cold. And then I'm gonna get my mojo and I'm gonna get to work. <laughs> Good morning guys, I've just got off a very positive um, work call, so I'm in a good mood <laughs> and I'm just feeling positive about things. I feel like if any of you are self-employed you will know how hard it is to like stay motivated and constantly like push yourself to do more etc etc. So I need, I'm the type of person that needs feedback and like encouraging words etc etc so whenever i have a call with my management and it's full of good news and feedback it's still great um so yeah i'm filming for the day one side of my hair is curly and the other's not so i need to sort that out not sure what's happening there um i've also just had a big parcel arrive so i'm gonna try and get a all filmed for today for YouTube and then I might even go for a drink tonight as it's Friday night um but yeah also my new books arrived if you know me you will know <laughs> I love friends and Chandler has forever been my favorite character so I bought Matthew Perry's book but purely because not just because I'm obsessed with him and I think he's hilarious, but I do really want to read about his story because obviously I've heard a lot. And I've grown up with addiction quite a lot in my family and stuff. So I just feel like I really want to read this because I know he suffered a lot with addiction and I just want to know more about his story. So this is the next book on my list. Um, that's pretty much all I've got to update you on today, I think. Also, I finally found a perfect pair of jeans. So let me get you off my tripod and just quickly show you. Okay, so they are like a tiny little bit big, but nothing a belt can't sort. Sorry, I was just filming there. Um, but yeah, these are the jeans. Let me just quickly take my slippers off so you can see the length. So they're like perfect length i love my jeans a little bit long so they sit over my shoe and when i wear boots they're literally perfect and they're so good i bought them in two colors so i've got this shade and then like a shade lighter um they were a great pair of jeans so i thought i would share but i'm going to unbox my package now but i'm not going to show you because i'm going to do a haul with that 